Good evening, guys. Welcome. My name is David Pinto. They also call me Tips with Dave, and welcome to another video on my YouTube channel. If you are watching this for the first time, welcome. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to the content that you're going to get here, which is related to marketing uh, and definitely cryptocurrency as well. So you're going to learn the skill sets. Okay, I'm all about skill sets, and which is why Tips with Dave, right? Because you give you tips in order for you to get the skill sets, and then you implement the skill sets to get the results. On a consistent basis okay uh, in this video guys we're gonna talk about traffic to understand the traffic flow what does that even mean okay what does that even mean so uh, I'm on my Facebook now in case you guys want to know uh, who I am how I look I'm not shooting this video with uh, uh, with the shared screen software so obviously sorry not shared screen software with um, my webcam isn't working so that's why I'm coming out uh, just with a usual video because I like to put out new content on my channel on a frequent basis okay uh, let's go ahead and look at it I want to tell you very specifically uh, about my system it's called the pro system so if you want to know more about the pro system there's a link in the comment section now if you like this video and you like this comment hit the thumbs up at the end wait for me to finish and everything and you can hit the thumbs up but right now I want to give you guys the value and content so what is traffic flow for you guys who don't know, traffic is a lifeblood of any business. The reason why Facebook even has a business itself is that they sell traffic. Okay, so let's go quickly just to our homepage, or even um, yeah, just let's go to homepage, and I'll explain to you what traffic is. So if I scroll down my homepage, okay, you're gonna suddenly start to see obviously everyone, um, my friends posting and stuff like that. But now let's see, I go up a bit. Let me see your founder magazine. This is an advertisement, right? So Facebook make, makes money on advertising. So allowing founder magazine to get traffic to their website. Now it's an e-commerce website. You can see it's a training, Shopify, all these kind of things, whatever. It may be you have an ad right here. So Facebook runs on these kind of things, right? What is the traffic flow? Everyone who gets started online, they can do two things, okay? Firstly, you can get organic traffic. One of the ways to get organic traffic is through SEO and YouTube and Google blogging. These are free methods where you put out content and you optimize, the key word there, guys, is optimizing, okay? You're optimizing your traffic in order for you, uh, your uh, content in order for you to generate leads, okay? So an ideal situation is you would have free content. For example, Facebook is a good way, okay? So if you put out content, 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 and there are people who say, hey, uh, I'm interested, right? So to give you an example, maybe I can show you right here. Somebody reached out to me the other day. Uh, here you go. Uh, not this, sorry. Elias. Somebody reached, me, reached out the other day and asked me about more content. I obviously sent my link, and that's how I generated a lead there, right? That is doing organically, where people can talk to you. In fact, I wrote the status here right now. Connecting with real honest people is the best way for you to bring, build your brand. So once you build your brand organically, then you will start to see more sales, see more people. Why? Because you have to know, like, and trust. And you have to build this know, like, and trust factor for your audience, for the people who are following you. You may start off without having any list. So it is a slow process that takes time if you're doing it the free way. A lot of people, um, including myself, we have software which we use and we pay a monthly fee for in order for us to run our systems, right? So you want to start to understand exactly how to generate as many leads as possible on a day-to-day -day basis. What I use the phrase is planting your seeds. Planting your seeds in different places, that makes sense, okay? The moment you start to gain more free traffic through YouTube, through Facebook, through Instagram, any other place, you start to realize that it is more about authenticity and being yourself, okay? Um, but paid traffic, on the other hand, has a different flow. So in my system, okay, if you go to tipsodave.com, you will, in fact, if you click the link below, you'll go here. I teach about this traffic flow, okay? You enter your email address, click get access, and then you'll, um, you'll finally come to the traffic section of the whole plan. Now, the traffic section has paid traffic involved right with paid traffic you send it to this page people uh people subscribe i have a way that i present it through my marketing system etc this is software that i use okay and they then 
purchase something. Now, one, once they buy from me, once I make a sale, I take a portion of that and I put it into an advertising fund that I call it. Okay. And this advertising fund allows me to build my business. Okay. Allows me to build my business. So that's why I, I love this advertising fund that I've created for myself because at each and every sale, I put a percentage of that into this advertising fund. But in the beginning, when you just get started and you already have a sale budget, you have to give yourself time for people to make, for you to get that sale. So this is what this video is about to show you exactly how the traffic flow works. Okay. Uh, I'm going to stop sharing my screen for a second and I'm going to open the whiteboard so that you guys can see. Hopefully that makes sense. Okay. And we're going to do something right here. I'm going to put an arrow. Let's put arrows. Okay. Double ended arrows. And I want to show you exactly, say if this is a timeline, okay? You open your business today and this is the direction it's going, okay? We'll do this very specifically in this manner. So that is how you are opening your business, okay? Start here. So let's uh, just put start your, so month one, let's put just month one, okay? first month okay that's where you begin and it's going in this direction now you may ask David uh, what am I doing how why are you talking about this right so on the first day you're gonna purchase traffic right this is the first day right here you're gonna purchase traffic now when you purchase traffic here this line this arrow that you see firstly is a journey okay this is positive, let's put this as, this is positive, okay? And this is negative. You always have to have a profit and loss, uh, expenditure, etc. right? So this is positive, this is negative. When you first, in your first month, you have a product, okay? And the product, let's say, uh, let's write here, okay? Uh, let's write product is, just let's say 15 US dollars, okay? Just to make it simple, I'll say 100. 100 US dollars, okay? That's the product and that's the sales that you need to make, okay? Uh, this is what you need to make. Now, in the beginning, so you purchase this product, you're already in minus because you uh, made an expenditure for your 100, right? In the beginning, but you're okay with it because you know that you wanna start. You purchase traffic. So this is the first, this line is the first traffic that you purchase. When you purchase traffic already, you are in the negative, okay? you're in the negative. Now, I'm gonna make the lines bigger as we go along. This is the first week, okay? You get some leads, May maybe somebody will buy, most probably they will not buy. In the first week, no one will buy. This is the second week. This is the third week. This is the fourth week, and that's one month. I'm gonna circle it here, guys, so you can see you're going into the negative as per this, right? So first month you're in the negative and you say, damn, first month I'm, I'm in the negative, I haven't made any sales, I haven't made any profit, but you still continue to do the same thing. You continue to do the same thing, okay? Uh, let's change the, the line a bit, okay? This is the second month. You start, you're going, you're making, it looks like you're digging a hole for yourself, right? Because you keep making, going into the negative. Negative, negative, negative. Now, Suddenly, you make a sale. Your negative becomes less. You had expenditure in the third month with your uh, with your traffic. You make a sale, it becomes less. Now, the the person from this first traffic order, after about two months, has said, "Hey, no, this guy is doing consistently. So let's purchase again." And your traffic, and you and you start to get another sale. Bar, po, po, up, sorry, a portion of it goes into your advertising budget, and you make another sale comes less, then you make another sale, comes closer, and then you're flat on the top. Okay, so one, two, three, four, and you start off the, the fourth month breaking even. This is just an example, guys, I wanna write here, so you guys know, uh, hypothetical example, okay? So just an hypothetical example, with uh, real numbers, how it works is a little different, okay? I'm using this as a hypothetical example because I want you to understand now. With real numbers, it might take more than uh, just three months, 
Okay, I use three months as an example because usually it takes that much time if your system is good. If you have a good automated system like the pro system down, uh, which you can find in the description, then it works well for you. Okay, um, now, but obviously I cannot guarantee that in three months it's going to happen. I cannot guarantee anything, guys. It depends on the consistency. So this is the traffic flow. You reach here and now suddenly you're only in profit. You start to make a profit. Sometimes the profit is less, sometimes the profit is more, sometimes the profit is less, sometimes the profit is more. So this is another month goes by, you're still above, can you see? You're still above the line. Then you make, this is another month, you're still above the line, okay? And then suddenly this, you go down a bit, because no one purchases, that's fine. The end of the month you go a bit down, but you already have your traffic budget, so you keep continue to purchase more. And this way, the traffic flow, as you can see, goes like this. And as you can see, it goes down first and then starts to go up. Okay? Then can go up and up and up and up and up. But you need to start. This section right here is what people don't understand. When you go and you purchase your first traffic, okay, a lot of people will, will stop. This is the section, okay, right here. Let's put an arrow again. Uh, this is a section right here where people suddenly stop. So literally, they give it the first month, right? And then, and then for some reason, then for some reason they just stop. And you ask yourself, why? Why do they just stop? They start out there. After the first month, they said, Oh man, I'm in the negative, I'm in the negative, I'm in the negative, I'm just gonna stop. So they don't go ahead. But the key is, you need to go ahead, need to go ahead, and then, then you, with the consistency, you start to see. So this is the traffic flow that I have, even for the micro, uh, for the, sorry, the, the, um, the pro system that I have in place with all the offers, okay? But you will definitely see that uh, in the beginning when you're purchasing traffic, if you don't understand how traffic works, you need to have it consistently. Whether it's Facebook, whether it's YouTube, what even if it's paid, YouTube, paid, Facebook, paid, solo ads, whatever it is, it has to have, you go out, out of pocket and then you come into the positive. Your aim should always be getting into the positive, but you have to have patience for it because your sales process might not be right. Don't blame it on the traffic. Your sales pr process might not be right. Okay. Your, um, your follow-up series might not be right. You might need to change it. You might need to update it. So give yourself time to perfect, or let's say, get it to the expert level of what you needed in order for you to make the sale. Okay, hopefully you guys understood. What you need to do is week in and week out, week in and week out, continue to send traffic, guys. Unless you're continuously sending traffic and you don't give up, you're not gonna see any results. In fact, 95% of the online marketers that join fail because of this. Okay, there's only 5% that don't quit. Are you going to make that decision to be that 5% or the 95% who just stop? That's up to you. So if you got value from this video and if you like the content that you get from this channel, obviously hit the subscribe button and check out the other videos obviously as well on the channel. Feel free to share it, hit the thumbs up or thumbs down in case you dislike it or you like it. And uh, let me know in the comments below what you think of a traffic flow plan. Okay, do you like this? You don't like this? This is the reality. So I would love to know your opinions and comments in the um, below. So let me know. Okay, have a great day. Keep paving the way for your dreams to come true. My name is David Pinto. They also call me Tips with Dave. And I'm going to see you in the next video.